Slovakia marked a significant step in its strategy to strengthen national air defense capabilities by expressing its intention to acquire the U.S. Patriot missile defense system. This announcement was made by Defense Minister Robert Kalanak during his appearance on the state television channel RTVS. He highlighted Slovakia's strategic interest in the Patriot system, emphasizing its acquisition as a key element in the country's ongoing modernization of its defense arsenal. Committed to supporting Ukraine since the onset of the conflict with Russia, Slovakia, a member of NATO and the European Union, has demonstrated solidarity by transferring much of its Soviet-era military equipment to Kiev, in the context of the Ringtosh program. This included MiG-29 fighter jets, BMP-1 armored vehicles, 152mm ammunition, and S-300 air defense systems. This move created a gap in Slovakia's defense capabilities, temporarily filled by Patriot batteries supplied by Germany, the Netherlands, the United States, and more recently by an Italian Mamba system. In the context of enhancing its autonomous air defense, Slovakia joined the European Sky Shield Initiative, ESSI, a NATO project initiated by Germany to develop an integrated European air defense system, including the procurement of Iris TSLM, Aero 3, and Patriot Pack 3 systems. This initiative follows a process initiated in May 2023 for the acquisition of advanced air defense systems, with proposals received from various international defense players. A team of Slovak experts evaluated these offers, leading to the government's approval on October 4, 2023, to acquire new systems. Among the systems considered, Poland's PO Run and Israel Aerospace Industries Barak MX system were selected for their ability to meet the country's air defense needs. The interest in the Patriot system and ongoing negotiations with Poland and Israel reflect Slovakia's continued commitment to strengthening its air defense. These modernization efforts, crucial for addressing regional and international security challenges, continue despite internal political changes. However, the political landscape in Slovakia has shifted with the return of Robert Fico as head of the government. Known for his critical stance on military aid to Ukraine and a defense agreement with the United States, Fico quickly marked his tenure by halting Slovak military aid to Kiev and opposing Ukraine's NATO membership. Despite this political direction, Slovakia appears determined to enhance its air defense. On January 28, 2024, Defense Minister Robert Kalanak announced Bratislava's intention to acquire Patriot air defense systems from the United States, a move considered the most significant contract in the history of the Slovak army. To finance this acquisition, Kalanak plans to use the $660 million from the U.S. Military Assistance Program, initially intended for purchasing AH-1Z Viper attack helicopters. Emphasizing the country's air defense needs, Kalanak stated that, Slovakia's priority is not the acquisition of attack helicopters but air defense. This decision signifies a strategic shift for Slovakia, moving towards enhancing its air defense capabilities while navigating a complex political context. The international community is closely monitoring the implications of these developments for Slovak defense policy and its position within NATO and the EU.